Language is uh, an identifier of a people, um, of a people of a certain region. And when you know and learn your language, then you kind of have a sense of self, a sense of where you come from, where you belong. It's good to have you here at the station because I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> I am just as nervous as you, Nan. I am. Eben Amensi was my grandpa, and he wrote the song Mongi Chamorro. He is someone who protected and perpetuated the Chamorro language and then also fought for the rights of the Chamorro people. I guess I would liken it to a call to our people of our island, you know, to really just come forth and stand up for what's right for not just, you know, our island, but our people. My grandparents, my whole life, they fought to have a say and to just live life and not have to constantly fight and fight to be heard. Decolonization to me means the independence to have a say in what happens to our island, but unfortunately we don't right now and that's what we're still fighting for. Having the ability to decide what happens to our island, being in control, whether it's our waters and the fishing and, you know, to save our resources. So really just deciding for ourselves what's best for our island and what's best for our island's future, especially for our children. Music is definitely an avenue that can be used for that purpose. You know, it's a way in which we can pass on our stories and in our language. independent lives is 
by teaching, teaching our children. When I give my children that, at least that, that opportunity to know and learn their language, no one's ever gonna take that away from them. It's not something that can be thrown away or taken away. They'll always know it, they'll always have it. And in having that, they'll know where they come from. You know, I don't really hear a lot of uh, people speak Chamorro. And growing up in a household where my grandma would speak and my grandpa and my mom, and it was just nice to know that our language is not uh, dying out. And I think through music, it really just holds um, the pieces um, of our history and, and everything we've gone through together and we um, pass it down uh, through generations to keep it alive. I'm scared because my mom and grandma are going to watch this. What <laughs> now?